It's the match the world makes time to watch. It's El Clasico, and it's our main feature today on EA TV. Real Madrid against Barcelona from the Bernabeu, and it's live. Welcome to you all to uh, the Bernabeu Stadium, the home of Real Madrid, on the day that Barcelona come a visiting. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. Alan. Yeah, can't wait for this one, Martin. When you think down the years of the contest, the goals, the theatrics sometimes from various players, but uh, there's never a dull moment. Luka Modric. Well, we've got a, a battle within the war today, haven't we, with the player getting his track at his old teammates? Yeah, and I think it's always an emotional time when you face your former club, so you just want to concentrate on doing himself justice. Madrid, Thibaut Courtois starts in goal, Rafael Varane starts with Sergio Ramos as the centre-backs, Paul Pogba plays with Kevin De Bruyne in central midfield, Neymar is the lone striker today. <laughs> Barcelona's line-up here, while well, the supporters here, they expect a certain type of football, don't they? intricate game really yes and uh, for the opposition I mean it can be incredibly frustrating just trying to get the ball back you've got to work really hard and uh, once you do you want to make sure you don't give it away because you might not see it again for two or three minutes Neymar chance for Neymar to show his dribbling ability has to score strange really from such a good position and such a good player because he's hit it so hard yeah, that's not like him at all. I don't know why he tried to finish like that. Sergio Busquets. Got to pass the ball a bit better than this if they're going to make progress. Couldn't it straight away? Looking at the best defence in the division at the moment in Real Madrid. Well, defending is an art and sometimes a forgotten one in this day and age, but this lot haven't forgotten it, that's for sure. Coutinho. Modric. Uh, cut out by the defender. Held off the defender with some good touches here. Aiming for Neymar. Only partially away from danger. Cleared away, well away from goal. The home team with all the cards here, it seems. Especially the points that they got for winning the away game on the ground of the opposition here. Tried his luck. It's bounced back off the bar. Fine margins down there. Woodwork playing its part but if they keep on playing like this I think the goal will soon come well he's had a go maybe a bit of a sighter but it was a strong effort I have seen him score from those kind of distances interesting to see what footwear the teams are going to actually use today now that this rain is coming down might have to change what they originally started with yeah and I think sometimes with the lads wearing blades these days you do see them slipping a bit more and uh, it might mean they have to change halfway through this match Tony Cross looking for a through ball. Just to keep it to beat. Really good chance for the opening goal, and it fell the way of Luis Suarez. I think he just took that a little bit too easily, Martin. There's 
gets the interception. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going, and read it. Well, they've got a corner out of that. A bit lucky, it was deflected. Tony Kroos, oh, for the next couple of hours or so, he's got to forget friendships. Try and outwit his former team. Yeah, well, they know all about him, and they know what a good player he is, so they'll be guarded. In goes the corner. Good defensive clearance there. Modric, Coutinho. Modric. Sergio Busquets. This is an exercise. Cut off! Good Suarez! Bit of space for him. Now out on the wing. In for Neymar. That's a shame, because in the end, that'll go down as a poor cross, really. Just a quick reminder for you, coming up on EA TV very soon, the Champions League fixture, Real Madrid, they'll be hosting Liverpool. Yeah, high-quality fixture, this one. There won't be much quarter given. Going for goal! Tried to keep it down, but couldn't. If he had it, I think the keeper might have been struggling there. to be able to switch the play there. Well, the history of this fixture really reflected in the way this uh, first 40 minutes or so is being played out. Nip and tuck and very, very close. It is, he thought. Must take the lead here. He's gone in with the header, but the ball nowhere near going into the net. I think it's come off the top of his head, that one. They've got the ball back by that interception. Jordi Alba. Well, here comes the support. And shoots! He can put them in front. Very close to giving them the lead. Messi. They'll get a free kick for that. Barcelona, what about their next game, Alan? Well, they've got Rea Vallecano in the next match in La Liga. I think they'll be fine. I think they'll, uh, they'll win it easily. Jordi Alba. They've gone and won it, Real Madrid. De Bruyne. Modric. Now it's Suarez. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Hazard. Christian Eriksen. Losing possession there, Kevin De Bruyne. Good reading of the play, anticipating the pass. And he could get away here. Saw the goal and went for it. It's in for Real Madrid, and Barcelona hang their heads. Well, it was on the card, they were playing so well now. Real Madrid get the thrill of scoring right on half-time. Well, that changes the team talk in that dressing room, doesn't it? What a, what a conversion. Let's see the replay now. the easiest of managers to work for, I know that, but these players are doing what he demanded beforehand now.
Real Madrid with the lead. Tony Kroos, Coutinho, Modric, Lionel Messi. It's Messi. Luis Suarez. So it's 1 0 here as the half time whistle goes. Well, with their defence, I think they'll feel, although it's a, a tightish game, they can see it through here, Alan. And with their defensive record, who would bet against them not winning this match? Settling back down here in the Santiago Bernabeu Stadium. Lionel Messi trying to thread a pass through, but not successful. Got a space for him. Now out on the wing. Got the ball away from the opposition. Got to keep it now. Tony Kroos. Sergio Busquets. Modric. To play well. Neatly intercepted. Here's a chance to whip it in. Switch of emphasis. Go. Letting the shot go. And into the net via the post. Right the side of the goal and nicking off the inside of the post on its way in. On another day that kind of rebounded back into play but not this time. And here is another angle on that goal. Well I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape and boy is he getting results out there. Restarting at 2-0. Tony Kroos, Modric, Modric, Coutinho. He can take the defenders on out wide here, Aiden Hazard. Neymar! They've set it up well for the cross. Real Madrid given the throw here. I guess he was aiming for a teammate, but he certainly didn't find one. Luis Suarez. Coutinho. A chance to break away now on the counter. Excellent interception. Messi! Well, in these circumstances, he's got to take that chance. Well, he certainly has. That's going to lift the team that's already ahead, and I think they're going to go on and win this now. Well, time is ticking away. It's time for a change, and here it comes. De Bruyne. Played through by Busquets. Luis Suarez! Oh, just shaved the bar. Yeah, unlucky. He hits it well enough. Oh, how about this? Listen to the crowd now. He's coming off, having uh, really taken this game by the scruff of the neck. Oh, he's a real favourite with these fans, an even bigger favourite now after that performance. Sergio Ramos. Substitute ready to come on for Barcelona. Well, this attack has got a bit of menace to it. He's tried his maybe a bit of a sighter, but it was a strong effort. I have seen him score from those kind of distances. It's a tactical substitution for the losing team here. <laughs> 
Samuel Umtiti. They've got the ball back by that interception. Jordi Alba, Luis Suarez. Dembele looking. Suarez here. Good width in the attack here, looking for a cross at the end of it. Saw the pass coming and got there first. Rakitic. On to Jordi Alba. And now the shot! Was a chance maybe to hit the target. He certainly went for strength. Nothing wrong with the connection either. Here's Casemiro. Here's Kevin De Bruyne. That's his game, isn't it? Intercepting. Real Madrid closing in on the victory that's always heralded when uh, one side or the other wins the Clasico. Yeah, I just wonder whether there'll be a sting in the tail to this match, whether Barcelona can get back into it. And shoots! Working hard to try and get a goal in a crowded area. Not the easiest chance he'll get today, I don't think. Pogba. Here's Casemiro. Neymar. Could get his cross in now. Defended well. Intercepted the play, saw the pass coming. And he bangs it away. It's 82 minutes played now. Plenty of space out wide, and they're going to use it. Now, can he take them on? Strong challenge. Here's Casemiro. Well, there's one for him to chase in behind. Brilliant pass, can he finish it? Quick reaction time here from the goalkeeper. Quick-witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. In behind the defenders. It's Neymar who's in. Superb save. He shouldn't have had a chance at all with that, but oh, what about those reflexes? Brilliant. Just one minute left on the clock. And the ball has gone up to indicate three added minutes. Tony Kroos, Ivan Rakitic, Dembele. It's a very good interception. Now it's Usman Dembele. And it's a win here as the final whistle goes for Real Madrid. Well, you don't have to dominate the football to win the match. This is a perfect example of it. No, there were times when they sat off, they allowed the opposition to have the ball, but really did counter-attack well. Well, they have had such a great defence, the home side, and they've added to that quality with some real attacking skill today. Yeah, really are gaining a reputation for their miserly record of goals conceded, and that was another example today.